I showed you two ways you can do this song. The first way was with uh, just playing the accompaniment um, and singing, doing the vocal line if you know the song. And the other way I just put the right hand, uh, put the melody in the right hand. I'm going to show you both ways. <clears throat> but uh, first let's do it as you would play it if you were just playing an accompaniment. And uh, this is part one to Unchained Melody. And uh, we'll finish it on the website, which is www.webpianoteacher.com. Or if you want to hire me for a request or have a, any questions uh, about getting lessons on DVD, just uh, send me an email to easypianolessons at yahoo.com. So let's do it as we would do it with, as an accompaniment. So what we, what we would do is play this bottom part, what I have usually as the left hand. We're going to play it with the right hand, okay? <clears throat> so let's start with middle C here on the right hand. Now let's go C, up to E, up to G, up to C. Ba, 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 then come back down. Then go back up. But not all the way up to C. We're going to go back down to E here. And then middle C. And then go down to a B. Cross over your pointer finger. Let me play the next measure. But Alright, now we're going to do sort of the same pattern here on A minor chord. Below middle C we have an A, and then middle C, and then E, and up to A, back down to C, and up to A, E, C, A, C, E. So this box here would be... Now let's go lower to an F, A, C chord. F, A, C, and then up to an F on the pinky. But bum, 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 bum. Continue with that chord, F, A, C, F. Up to middle C, A, so this part, this is actually, should be the same box, but. And then we have G, B, D, G, come back down, come back up, go back down, so that one's pretty easy. And then we're back to C. octaves and the way you know which note to play on the left hand is whatever the first note of that box is so this is uh, C here so let's play a C octave in the left hand and let's just play it every six notes now it's going to be an A octave on the left hand now it'll go to an F octave on the left hand the right hand with your left hand instead. So you can do it in two places. You can do it right here, you know, or you can do it up here. It doesn't matter if you like this sound better. That's fine if you want it right here. You can still play the melody up here or right here. If you like it up here the way I did it. octaves in the right hand if you can do that. Play it exactly right, but you know, just giving you uh, lots of options and you could even, you know, play it as variations, play it over and over again doing it uh, different ways each time. But I'm just going to show you right here because it's in the middle of the piano and it's easiest for me to, to teach you that. So let's do the left hand all the way through the way we would do it uh, in this fashion with uh, uh, left hand as accompaniment and right hand with the melody. So left hand would do this. By the way, here's middle C and there, here's the C I'm starting on. Second box. but this C here. You can also play it up here if you wanted. But C, hold it up for a while. Hit it pretty hard because it's got to last. And then up to an E, down to D, down to C. Now here if you want to go da da da, you can do that. I just put a D. But D, C. If you want to go E, D, C, that would be fine. And then a D. 
and then E, D, C. Hold that out, and another C, down to G, up to B, up to D, up to E, down to C, and then a D to end with. All right, if we put it hands together, we have this. Just play the right hand with wherever there's a vertical line. You know, line them up. So here's the first box. Here together. So those three are together. And then the next box. And then this is together. And then together, together, together. hand too loud, you want that melody to come out. And since there's so many notes in the uh, <clears throat> left hand, it's, it's going to you know, be more prominent anyway, so try to keep it down. Enjoy it.